FBI Director Kimi claims more evidence that North Korea hacked Sony. The hackers responsible for infiltrating Sony Pictures Entertainment, leaking a trove of sensitive and embarrassing corporate information and ultimately delaying the theatrical release of the interview, had internet addresses that were exclusively used by North Korea, FBI Director James Kimi said Wednesday. His announcement was meant to put to rest lingering skepticism among cybersecurity experts that U.S. authorities were correct to blame Pyongyang for the high-profile hack. The FBI determined with very high confidence that North Korea orchestrated the attack, Kimi said, citing multiple occasions when the hackers failed to reroute their connection through proxy servers. The group, known as the Guardians of Peace, got sloppy, the director said at an event at Fordham University in New York City. Kami said the evidence indicates the hackers infiltrated Sony by spear phishing fraudulent emails which attempt to point specific individuals to a dangerous link. The FBI formally blamed North Korea for the hack on December 19, citing similar malware and methodology previously used to carry out hacks against South Korea. For example, there were similarities in specific lines of code, encryption algorithms, data deletion methods and compromised networks, the Bureau said in a statement at the time. U.S. President Obama backed up the FBI's assertions later that day, but technical experts immediately warned that, based on the evidence made public by the FBI, there was reason to doubt North Korea's involvement. North Korea isn't traditionally associated with major cyber operations, some said, and the Korean dialect discovered within the malware code may have been planted in an 